Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Coding Together. My name is Vikas Oja. Today we will see a read code problem. Construct binary tree from pre-order and in-order traversal. So we are given with two arrays, pre-order and in-order. We need to construct a binary tree from uh, these traversals. So it's a reverse of the, uh, the the reverse of what we generally do. We have we usually have a tree and we perform pre-order in order. Now it's a reverse from the pre-order in order. We have to construct a tree. So let's see how, how we can do it. So, so we are given with pre-order, pre-order and in order. So when we say pre-order, it means first we will iterate root, then left, then right. And for in order, it means first we'll go left, then root, then right. So what idea we are getting from these two traversal is that if we take the first element of the pre-order, it will be a root. And if we take, and for this root, if we find the index in the in order traversal, and uh, if, if, if we find the index, corresponding to this root in the in order traversal the indexes on the left side of that particular and on the found index and the index on the right side will go as a left and right child respectively for example if we take 3 so this is the index that is 1 so on the uh, this this is the root node and we found in the in order at index 1 so on the left of this index 1 that is 0 will go as a left child and all the three elements on the right of this index will go as a right child a right subtree you can say so uh, how we will approach it so first we will make a map for in order like storing the value and the index so 3 will be at 1 15 will be at 2 20 will be at 3 and 7 will be at 4. So we have stored all the values and their corresponding indexes. So step 1 what we will do we will take the first element 3 create a node and increment. So the, our pointer will maintain a pointer maybe we can call it pre order index. So we started with 0 took 3 incremented it to 9 now it will point to 9 this index we found the corresponding index with this value so 3 is pointing to 1 so what we will do is we will uh, attach this root node the left child will be the list from this in order from 0 to what the index is 1 so if 1 minus 1 that is 0 and the right subtree for this root node will be the index is 1 that we found out so after 1 that is from 2 to the rightmost index that is 4 0 to 4 now again uh, we will perform we will again pick uh, the element that will be 9 so that will be our root node again we will check for this uh, so we have to pick the values uh, for, uh, the values from the pre-order to be as a root node and uh, the left and right subtree will be decided by the in order so we the pre-order index was pointing to 9 that is the first index now we will we saw that the 9 is on the left side zeroth index so we will make it as a root node then we will see the index uh, 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 for the line that is 0 so on the left we uh, it's the first element so before this there is nothing so it will be null and after that uh, uh, we entered with 0 comma 0 we have to see the elements uh, right uh, left and right child for 9 only between 0 comma 0 when we entered 
uh, when we created three for this because for three the left part subtree is only this part so we cannot include all these for nine so we have to see for, from zero to zero so uh, there is nothing on the right side of the nine uh, uh, like it, it it's uh, it, it, there is a uh, three on the right side but for the left subtree of three we cannot include it so it will again be null on the right side so now again we will this is incremented so we will check uh, our uh, will increment our pre order index so it will be pointing to 20 now so 20 will become our root and now to decide the left and the right side so the left is 2 <coughs> and rightmost is 4 for this node for 20 so now we will find the index of 20 from the in order that will be 3 so from 2 to 3 uh, 2 to 2 sorry because uh, index 3 minus 1 that is 2 from 2 to 2 the all the elements will go in the left subtree and from 3 plus 1 4 to 4 will go on the uh, right subtree of the node 20 so from 2 to 2 there is only one node that is 15 and from 4 to 4 there is only one node that is 7 now we will take 15 so we will see that uh, what what is the value uh, root node for 15 uh, uh, what is the in order value for 15 what is the index so for corresponding 15 is here so for 15 as it index 2 and uh, we will get out of bound uh, when we will do uh, the left is 2 rightmost is 2 so we cannot this is only one element we cannot mix left hand subtree because 2 uh, the index is 2 2 minus 1 will be 1 so it and the left most allowed is 2 so we cannot go 1 so it will be null and again same if the index the 15 is at 2 but for the right subtree we cannot go 2 plus 1 because the only allowed is 2 to 2 so we will assign null and null for these values now we will see we will increment our value to 7 and 7 is the is here at the uh, rightmost of the in order that is at index 4 so this is again we have the ending in right left and right allowed for 7 is 4 and 4 so all the elements uh, so if we want to take elements on the left subtree of 7 then we have to go from 4 minus 1 that is 3 but the subtree allowed for 7 is from 4 to 4 uh, so it cannot have that elements and for the right side also we cannot have because it's only allowed till 4 so we cannot go 4 plus 1 so in this way uh, we, we have created a tree with all the nodes and the uh, left and side uh, childs so let's see the code for it so we have made a pre-order index we have created a map uh, so map will store the in order values and the index we'll start the process with the zero and the rightmost uh, index of the pre-order that is this one zero and the rightmost so we'll check we'll have our base condition that is le if left is greater than right we'll return null so as soon as the for this suppose the left was 4 right was 4 now when we did 4 minus 1 it uh, became smaller than the left uh, left pointer <coughs> left value so it will we will have the as a null at our base condition now uh, we will have the value from the pre-order we'll take the value from the pre-order array increment the index and create a tree node so we took the first value from the pre-order and we created the node and for, uh, for this node root 
left node we will again perform the by, uh, operation binary search tree we recursively call with pre order left and will for the left part as we saw when we added 3 the left part will be the whatever the value we will get from the index minus 1 and right part will be plus 1 so that's what we have written for the left will on we are if we are going left the left will remain as it is and the right will become minus 1 and for the right part the uh, right part will become plus 1 and right extreme and the right will remain as it is and once we have done the iteration we will return the root and this will uh, be, we will create a tree so let's see uh, uh, let's try to run this program and it's accepted so yeah thanks for watching this video uh, i hope to see you again in my next video till then please share and subscribe this video to keep me motivated to present more such videos thank you